In this question, we're given an infinitely long sum. 0.1 plus 0.01 plus 0.001, and so on and so on and so on. We're going to add up an infinite amount, of, an infinite number of terms, and say, well, does that actually make something? It shouldn't be surprising if the answer is yes, because it, that should remind you of our improper integrals, where we had an integral that went all the way out to infinity, but it still might add up to a finite number. A similar thing can happen in this case. The way to approach the thinking for these problems, and this really is a formal definition that we'll look more at later, how do I add up an infinite amount of things? Well, we're going to start by saying that uh, we're going to give these things terms, uh, a1, a2, a3, a4, and so on and so on and so on. And what we're going to do is make a, what we call a sequence of partial sums. Partial sums will be add up the, the first set of, of entries, or the first set of terms in the sum. Right, so S1 is just going to be take the very first term. S2 will be take the first two terms. So S1 is just A1, S2 is A1 plus A2. So S for sum, this is the first partial sum. This is the second partial sum. S3 will be A1 plus A2 plus A3. S4 will be A1 plus A2 plus A3 plus A4. And so on and so on and so on. So this is going to give me a list of numbers. It's going to give me a sequence. The sequence of partial sums. S1, S2, S3, and so on and so on and so on. We say that this sum, this infinite sum, exists if the sequence of partial sums has a limit that exists. If the partial sums are getting closer and closer and closer to something, that something is the infinite sum that we started with. In this example, this works out rather nicely. 0.1 and then 0.1 plus 0.01 is 0.11. S3 will be 0.111. Each time I add up a new entry, I'm adding a 1 at a later decimal place. This is 0.111. So this total sum, 0.1 plus 0.01 plus 0.001 plus forever on out, is going to be the limit as n goes to infinity of the sequence of partial sums. Well, what's happening to these numbers as I go further and further and further down the list? I'm getting an extra 1. Each time I go, in the limit, I'm going to get a 1 everywhere, which is 0.1 repeating.